we're going to look at two basic measurement conversions here. The first one is converting centimeters, to be exact, 600 centimeters, and we're trying to find out how many meters 600 centimeters is equal to. First thing to note, centimeters are a smaller unit of measure. A centimeter is smaller than a meter. So, what we need to know is that when we go from a smaller unit to, and we're converting it to a larger unit, we are going to divide because our number, if we have 600 of a super small unit and we're then going to change it to a large unit like a meter, the number has to get smaller. So we're going to divide. The next thing we need to find out is what are we going to divide by? Well, I know that there are 100 centimeters in one meter. So that means I'm going to divide by 100. So I start with 600 centimeters. When I divide by 100, I get a total of 6 for my correct answer of 6 meters. I'm going to draw a little line across to separate this because next what we're going to look at is going from feet to inches. Well, when we have feet and inches, feet is the larger unit and we're converting it to the smaller unit of inches. And whenever we do that, start with a larger unit and go to a smaller unit, we are going to multiply. So, now we have to ask ourselves what we'll multiply by. Well, one foot is equal to 12 inches. Here's where knowing your measurement conversions comes in handy. So our problem is now 12 multiply times 12. 12 times 12 is 144 for the correct answer. It's a great, uh, it's very smart to make sure you follow these three steps when converting. Always think, am I going from a larger unit to a smaller unit or a smaller unit to a larger unit? That will tell you whether to multiply or divide. Then think of the measurement conversion between the two and then solve the multiplication or division problem to correctly convert units from one measurement to another.